Welcome to our 16th vlog. We are driving to Wellington today. It's our biggest drive we've done so far. It's probably gonna take about five hours yeah. of constant driving, so with brakes a bit longer. And we know from a friend that we met traveling from their Insta story actually, that it is snowing in parts of the South Island. Yes, in Dunedin, it is snowing. So that could be really fun as That's well. That's where we're heading first in so, the South. Mayor. Mayor? <laughs> we'll see you on the road. Rainy right now. Izzy's driving, she's really enjoying it. <laughs> I'm not. <laughs> the wind keeps pushing the camp van all over the road, and we just went into the mountains as you probably just saw, and it's mental. Scary. Really scary. A very wet one near Wellington today. It's known as the Windy City, so it makes sense with the wind, I guess. Hi guys, it's a while since we've talked to you. It's because it's sort of been constantly raining and wet and a bit of a nightmare really. We decided to go down to Wellington. Hello! We were thinking of going to the cinema or going to a museum or something, but when we actually arrived due to traffic, it was nearly five o'clock, so all the museums were closing. Sadly. And we actually couldn't agree on a film <laughs> to go and see. So and we ended we up just going shopping and then getting a quick bite to eat. It was raining. A lot. It was constantly raining. We were like sprinting around. We also had a bit of a nightmare. One of the ciders opened itself on yeah. the drive. It's on my clothes. And it got on Izzy's clothes, which are under the bed. Yeah, so we haven't talked to you much. No. But we will be having a bit more of an exciting day tomorrow. We're getting the early ferry to the South Island. So we're going across the Cook Strait. Most beautiful ferry ride in the world, apparently. It takes about three hours. One thing I was talking to Izzy about before is that perhaps from the view of the vlog, we might not be doing much. <laughs> we're not doing much like hiking, we're not doing many activities. Mm. And it's funny because it seems like we're not doing a lot of stuff, but we actually are, and that's driving. Like we're doing hours of driving every day. Today we drove for four hours. And we honestly just, that is the best way to see New Zealand. Everything is so beautiful. Apologize for not much filming today, but it's yeah. constantly raining. We will see you tomorrow. Peace. Good morning. We are up driving to the ferry to take us over to Picton. Jacob's in a very moody mood this morning. I think it's because we had to wake up early. I, on the other hand, am absolutely fine. Inter Islander ferry between Wellington and Picton. It takes about three, three and a half hours. This is the map. <laughs> Basically, this is so it's called the Cook Strait. And then you go through these beautiful islandy, headlandy bits. It is beautiful. Yeah. Sometimes on a good day, you can see whales and dolphins when you're going through this island. Watching 
Good afternoon from the vlog. We just got to our campsite and we're staying at a place called Pekata. Holiday camp. Or Pekata Holiday, Holiday Camp. Or park. It's That's really like good for us. Nine kilometers south of Kaikura. Yeah. And it's really cold. <laughs> and it's right next to the Kaikura um, airport. airport. They only have like tiny planes and helicopters. And We're on a beautiful beach right now and our camper van is 10 seconds walk behind us. It's amazing. We drove for about two and a half hours. Well, it would have been two and a half hours constant today. It was actually yeah. three and a half hours because I was stopped. constantly stopping to get a film and just having like staring at sights really. Until I fell asleep. Yeah, Izzy fell asleep <laughs> for like 40 minutes and missed all the coastal roads. Yeah, trust me. <laughs> One thing about New Zealand we're finding for sure is that food is surprisingly expensive. Yeah, we arrived and we didn't think it was that bad and then we actually thought about it and it, it is. is yeah. Even like, a pepper. Yeah. Yeah, so that's a bit a good example. <laughs> a red pepper or a capsicum over here is about one pound fifty. Whereas for, at home it's one like veg. forty pence. Yeah, it's crazy. So I don't think petrol's much more than the UK. Petrol, I think, is yeah. normal. Yeah, maybe a bit cheaper. Yeah. I'm sorry if the mic keeps dropping down, but it's we still broken. We need to broken. buy a new one. <laughs> We're putting off buying a new mic. It is working. It's just got no stand, so it sort of sits on top of the camera and constantly annoys us. <laughs> Look. It's so evil, right? Look at this. This is our mic. It's got this little lead, but the actual bit is broken on it. It's a nightmare. Just having a quick barbecue, as you can see on there. We're cooking chicken satay. We have a random meal tonight. We're having Mexican baked beans, chicken satay, and some like Mexican microwave rice. <laughs> so as usual, we just chilled out tonight and drank a good amount of wine, and then edited for a bit. Uh -huh. Time for bed. Nice day today. Feels like a long day. It felt like a long day of driving, but I mean, it wasn't really. Hmm. It's because we were on the ferry as well. Yeah. Exhausted. <laughs> mm. So we're gonna get up early from now on and try and get the drives done. Yeah, because then we can have an enjoyable afternoon. <laughs> and basically get more activities done. Good night. Good morning viewers. Hello. Bye. Two and a half hours to Christchurch. We're excited because we're actually staying two nights there. So we get to do loads of activities and I think we're going to the Antarctic Centre today. Which I'm really excited for. Yeah, currently driving along the coast as you can see behind me. It's absolutely stunning. But this constant road works along this road so it's a bit awkward. They originally built, they say in the 60s for the Swedish army and from then on they've been using the Antarctic to get around. They can go at 45 degree slopes, they're fully float, floatable? Yeah. Fully submersible? Fully submersible. Something. I don't know, something. They can float for th up to three hours at a time. Yeah. <laughs> we went on a big assault course, that was so fun. good. Having a lot of fun so far. It's going to get cold soon. <laughs> Swimming and everything. Is it? It's right there. Hello. Hi. So we finished.
with the Antarctic Centre, which was fantastic. I loved that place. Totally, totally worth it. Mm. We are now in Christchurch. Botanic uh, Gardens, I think. Botanic Gardens. It's sort of all a massive park, and yeah. then the Botanic Gardens are in a separate bit. We're like 10 minute walk outside of the actual city centre, so we thought we'd park here, mm. have a little walk, and then wander into the city. And it's lovely. I love the feel of this place already. I know you can't really tell much from the outskirts, but I like it. <laughs> Good evening. We haven't vlogged for a while because we haven't really been doing much. It's really nice falling into a sort of general schedule with the van. Excuse me, sorry. Yes. <laughs> no, on the way to the campsite we go shopping for our dinner, then we pull up, we get our camp, whatever, we cook dinner, and then we edit. Yep, so I'm getting lots of videos sorted out. Yes. And yeah, there isn't much vlogging to be done in the evenings. No. The end of the 16th vlog. Hope you enjoyed it. We're having a fantastic time in New Zealand so far. It's a very different life to backpacking and being in a hostel, but we really like it. Remember to hit that like button and subscribe and to the channel. Smash the subscribe button. <laughs> and hit the little bell so you get a notification every time we post. And we'll see you in the next one. See ya. Bye.